So a uh, bit of an update with the uh, with the CYC. Um, as you can see, I've had it off the bike and I'm going for this uh, mid-frame mounting style, which uh, I'm quite happy with at the moment. I think it's going to look really good in the middle of the frame here. Um, so, so far, all I've done really is to get it in there and I've made uh, a 3D printed uh, mount for the controller unit, which won't fit with this um, where it used to be. Um, so at the moment I've got it on here. Um, it's held on well enough, but it's a little bit loose, so I want to work on that. So uh, I think I'm going to go with a kind of a rail system uh, that utilizes the uh, the brazon water bottle holders or other mounts that, that you get on a bike. Um, and if I kind of make a locking rail system, um, maybe other people can use this design on their bikes too, because um, then I'd only have to change the diameter of this fitting piece. Um, for different diameter down tubes, um, bottom tubes, um, it might even go up on a on a top tube. Um, but yeah, it should give you quite a versatile fit there. So that's what I'm working on at the moment. Um, I haven't got it hooked up yet, I haven't got it running yet, but it's going to be going in there and it's going to give excellent ground clearance. Um, I didn't really like the way it fitted there at all. Um, I'm also working on a way uh, to do away with this with this strap, which I didn't really like, to be honest. I can see why they've done it, so it fits lots of different bikes. Um, so what I think I'm going to do is uh, make a bracing piece on on like a mount here, and then basically brace the motor against this um, down tube. I think it's the down tube or the bottom tube, or um, so brace it against that, so that will lock the motor in place so it can't go anywhere and then I don't have to have this strap flapping around down the back here which for such a cool looking motor I know it's a bit ghetto but um, I guess it works uh, so that's where I am at the moment um, once I've got that all squared away um, the next sort of project I'm looking in is actually a battery one um, and I have a bunch of this uh, graphene panther uh, lipo batteries so I'm trying to move into that a little bit and make a really high performance battery pack um, that gives a lot of amp draw capacity and I'm looking to do some snow racing uh, especially on the fat bike um, there's a uh, racetrack fairly near here and it opens up on a lake and then when it freezes over they, they cut an ice track so I'm going to be looking to do um, some racing on there hopefully this winter um, so that's it for the moment with with the cyc hopefully have another update over the weekend or so once i start to get things more more in place and i work a bit more on the 3d design um, so just a quick reminder i am running a competition um, to win a uh, lucky bling ring at uh, 500 subscriber mark and also uh, to win an egg rider v2 at the uh, 1000 subscriber mark and all you have to do is submit a comment on one of my videos um, all the details for that will be in the description below all right that's it cheers